welcome to another edition of Mulatto 5. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have three out of the four here with the babies. Well, it will be four out of the babies. Um, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. We're on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube. So today is just a quick video about pregnancy. So we had a um, 35 week checkup today. Uh huh. Booked in for the 36 week ultrasound next Tuesday, as well as um, removal of cervical stitch. I'm not looking forward to that. It's going to be so painful. Um, hopefully the knots at the front. Fingers crossed. Um, and then also we've been told that we're getting induced on the 7th of December. Um, they're going to do it through ARM, so that's rupturing membranes, water, and um, I believe also an IV drip because baby is already measuring at 38 weeks and we've only just hit 35. Um, so that's just exciting. You know, we'll have a baby in three weeks. Um, Egbert went to school today. He was a bit upset. Zakai, you can wait. He was a bit upset, but he'll be all right. No. Judah, did you have fun today at the doctor's? No. No, no you were playing with all of the no. toys? Ah. Oh. But yeah, so... Um, and me too. You too. Okay. So cervical stitch removal next Tuesday, as well as ultrasound next Tuesday. And... Um, then induction on the 7th of December, which is three weeks away. Um, am I prepared? Not really. For this one, I'm really not prepared. Um, usually with all the other ones, I would have everything by now. I would have got all of the stuff. But I think I've just been procrastinating and waiting to the last minute. So now I'm just really like, okay, I really need to start to get things ready. Um, we've got the basic essentials, of course. So I guess that's all that really matters. Um, plus, because I didn't think I was having any more children, I donated all of the clothes and stuff to charity. So we're rebuilding up all the clothes, which is good anyway, because it's a summer baby. So all the other ones were kind of winter babies. Yeah, been getting really severe RLS the last few days. Um, the only thing I've found that's actually helping it besides a magnesium tablet and the um, vitamin C and the iron tablets is hot showers because I can't have a bath because of cervical stitch. So every single night I've been having a hot shower literally 10 minutes before I go to bed. So around 11 o'clock at night I'll have a hot shower and then jump in bed, put some relaxation music on in my ears and go to sleep. However, if one of the children wake me up <laughs> and it's like I've kind of got to do it all over again, yeah, it's usually you, exactly. Um, yeah, but besides that, I think the children are kind of looking forward to having another brother. Um, Zakai, we'll see how he goes. <laughs> he still very much plays the whole baby. I'm the youngest, so, you know, I think he'll be all right. Maybe at first he'll have his nose pushed out a bit. But, um, we also usually do gifts for the babies. So, what we'll do... Okay, what we'll do is um, we'll buy just little little tiny toys, like, you know, it might be like a Transformer, a Wiggles, a Mr. Maker, or a Dinosaur, or something like that. And on the day that they come to see the baby, um, we'll give, it, give them each a gift from the baby. So that kind of builds the rapport and straight up, like, I don't know, they're happy. Like, they feel the baby's going to keep giving them gifts or something. <laughs> It works though, it does work. Um, just wait a second. Um, by the way, we're not driving, we're just sitting in the car at the moment. Um, what else? A lot of pressure, a heap of pressure is on the stitch at the moment to the point where it's almost agonizing at times. But you know, as a mum of already a few children, you have to keep going, 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 going. Um, what else? Yeah, just pretty much I've already started nesting, starting to get things cleaned and stuff like that. 
even things that don't really need cleaning. Um, but that's what us women do. We nest, we're little birds. <laughs> Um, what else? There's nothing really else to report. Haven't had any cravings. That's pretty much out the window. The heat is killing me, but getting there. You know, I'm getting there. Um, each day at a time. Try not to think too negative about things. Just trying to stay positive because you got to enjoy your pregnancies. Sorry about the noise in the background. My children have been little monsters today. Feet off the chair, please. Um... But yeah, so we're looking forward to it. And that's all of the news that I've got at the moment. I might go into a bit more detail later on about the cervical stitch and usually how they remove it and stuff. But for today, for now, I should say that's it.